Hey, New York. Uh, this is Clark with TV Mountain, New York City. Uh, so this video is a reaction to the New York Times video, a uh, New York Times wire cutters article, the best TV wall mount. And uh, overall, a uh, wire cutter usually has some good articles. Um, I think this is a good list. They have four four mounts listed here, but I think that uh, there's some some issues uh, with some of these mounts. I'm gonna explain why. So first of all, their overall best mount was uh, the Sanus um, flat mount. Now, for most people, um, I think this kind of mount is pretty decent. It uh, has a, 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 a tilt, a, a slight tilt. Um, it's kind of expensive. Um, the the tilt that you're gonna get really isn't gonna do anything. That's just my opinion. I don't think it really does much of anything. It's a minimal tilt, and it's not like you're gonna be adjusting your TV every week and everything. It's. Um, I think you're better off if you, if you're gonna get if you're gonna invest in a flat mount. This is just my opinion. You're better off getting something that. Uh, you can get like a good you know, economy mount that's strong and just flat and it sits on the wall and it's, it's a lot less a uh, lot and it's a lot less uh expensive than uh, 130 bucks 150 bucks you can get like a good uh, stock mount for excuse me you can get a good stock mount for like you know 35 50 bucks and it's flat on the wall and doesn't it's not doesn't and there isn't much space between the tv and the wall um, but again, this is a bit expensive. This uh, Sanus uh, VMPL50A B1. It's a bit expensive. Um, I like flat mounts. The only issue is again, if you ever foresee yourself, you know, adding any HDMI ports and everything. If if you have a TV and the HDMI ports are not easily accessible, then it means removing the TV and that can be a headache. And then remounting it. So, um, if, if you're just putting your TV on a wall, and you know, you know, you know, and you already had, uh, someone like us come out and do the installation, run your HDMI cables and like one or two extras, you got to go, you know, cause HDMI is kind of really being phased out anyway. But, um, I don't know. I think this is a little bit expensive and it, most people really don't need a tilting flat mount. If you're just going to get a flat mount, you're good to go. Um, now the next one that they had was, uh, the Sanus VLF728B2. This is a really good mount. It's a $300, it's a tad bit expensive, but I'm going to tell you, um, I've installed a few of these and they're really rock solid. I, I really like them. Um, they're secure. Uh, I think they're the safest kind of mounts. If you're, if, if, if you need like a full motion mount. And most people, again, they don't. Um, but this is the kind of full motion mount that you should get. It really supports the weight of most TVs. Um, so that's just my opinion. This is a really uh, a good mount. Um, the next one was a mono price uh, TV wall mount, tilt mount. Again, again, I don't think tilting is a big, big thing. I think that. Uh, most people don't use that feature when they have a flat mount. They just want it flat on the wall. Um, but again, uh, some if now it's only twenty seven dollars. This uh, mono price TV mount, and I think that that's a a good a good uh, a good price for a flat mount. Um, Set thirty, but the down you know it's thirty seven to seventy inches, so. It'll fit most smaller TVs, you know, up to about 65. I wouldn't go beyond 65 for this mount, 65 inches. <clears throat> uh, next, the last one was uh, the Echo Gear EGL F2 um, full mount. This is pretty good. Um, this is, it's, it's a good uh, full motion mount. Any full motion mounts, in my opinion, that uh, have two arms are a good investment to a degree. As long as they can support the weight of the TV. And the two mounts listed in this article are strong enough 
to support the weight of uh, most TVs. All right. So really good article by uh, Wirecutter, Best TV Wall Mount. I think that uh, they usually come through with some really good uh, reviews. All right. And uh, so if you need any help installing any of these mounts, and uh, we would love to help you. Um, and also one of the things when they uh, list these, uh, the mounts, they list the weight of the the, the, the maximum recommend <clears throat> the maximum recommended weight and that's really important when you're dealing with full motion mounts especially the maximum weight you know you can have a full motion mount and then your TV is you know you get you get a full motion mount maybe you got a TV that's too heavy for it and this will this will definitely damage the mount and it could also possibly compromise the uh, the um, the installation as well all right um because of the weight of the tv so again this is a really good article wire cutter um, best tv wall mounts so i'm looking forward to more articles by wire cutter and uh, if we can help you with uh, tv wall mount installation in new york city please let us know thank you so much